And now, Storm Tracker weather with meteorologist Michael Ottovino. Good morning, everyone, and happy Friday. Another active weather day ahead of us. There is still a winter storm warning in effect for parts of western Wyoming, and that's because your areas could see anywhere from 1 to upwards of about 11 inches of snow. So that storm system that moved through our area yesterday and is continuing to move through Idaho and western Wyoming is, was really a big snowmaker and also a rainmaker. We saw lots of, of rain yesterday across the Snake River Plain. There's also winter weather advisory still in effect until 5 p.m. today. More snow is, is in the forecast for Soda Springs, Island Park, Driggs as well. Anywhere from one to six inches of snow is likely for today. And for the Snake River, River Plain specifically, there's a, a wind advisory in effect. It's going to be a windy day out here for Pocatello, Blackfoot, Idaho Falls, Burley, even American Falls for today. We could see wind, gust, wind gusts upwards of about 45 miles per hour. And that's primarily during the, the early afternoon hours. We're starting off breezy across the Snake River Plain, also with some clouds in the sky. But those winds, they'll start to pick up right around 2 p.m. Pocatello 27 miles per hour wind speeds Idaho Falls 20 miles per hour and that's going to be the case just for the first half of the day the winds become more normal and they do they do subside later in the day as far as temperatures go right now we're in the 20s and the 30s across all of Idaho it's 37 degrees right now in Pocatello it's 36 in Idaho Falls it's 31 in Jackson and a little bit cooler in the Central Mountains coming in at 27 degrees in Stanley for the satellite and radar we're seeing those clouds and all that snow just out to our west. Those are going to move into our area for today, specifically across the Snake River Plain, and that's going to be the case for most of the day today. We'll see some scattered snow showers, not much in terms of sunshine. If we do see any sunshine, it will be primarily during the afternoon hours, right around 4 or 5 p.m. The snow is right around the Snake River Plain at 9 a.m. We're seeing those scattered snow showers, and they're going to be continue to be scattered throughout the day today, even around 4 p.m. We could even see some more snow, and that's going to taper off right around the evening hours so we'll have a clear evening with just with some clouds in the sky but not much in terms of precipitation across the Snake River Plain for this evening. As far as temperatures goes it's a chilly day out there. Temperatures are only in the 40s. It'll be 41 in Pocatello, 40 in Blackfoot, 39 degrees in Idaho Falls and for this evening those lows it's gonna be chilly out there. We're seeing single digits upwards to about 20 degree temperatures so it's gonna be another chilly night. 24 degrees for your low tonight in Pocatello, 22 in Blackfoot and 7 degrees tonight in Yellowstone. Let's have a look at that seven day forecast. The weekend, it's looking really nice. We're expecting mostly sunny skies throughout all of the weekend. Then on Monday, we do have a threat for rain. And the same is true for Idaho Falls. Some snow to start the day today. Sunshine for the weekend, rain on Monday. For the Teton area, Jackson, Afton, and Driggs, we'll see some snow today. It'll be a bit windy out there as well. Some clouds for Saturday, but sunny skies for Sunday. And the same is true for the Central Mountains, Salmon, Chalice, and Mackey. Partly cloudy skies on Saturday, and then all sunshine for Sunday.